Finally, it's the trip of a lifetime for three space fanatics aboard Virgin Galactic's first space tourism flight. Gotti Schwartz with the civilian astronauts who have just made history. Three, two, one, release, release, release. This is the moment. <laughs> it all changed for these newly minted space voyagers, not test pilots or trained astronauts, but ordinary people. We're in the vertical headed towards space. They rocketed at three times the speed of sound to an altitude of more than 50 miles and then zero G. Zero gravity felt like nothingness. It was the most peaceful, serene moment ever where everything just stopped. Natives of Antigua, Keisha Shahoff and her 18-year-old daughter, Anna, are not only the first mother and daughter duo to reach space, they're also the first female astronauts from the Caribbean. What do you hope little girls back on the island seeing this happen feel after seeing what you guys went through? I hope they feel invincible. Like it's okay to dream. It's okay to have these crazy dreams. And the heroes welcome for John Goodwin from his wife of 52 years. The former British Olympian who's battling Parkinson's disease bought his ticket back in 2005, waiting nearly two decades for this view. Even at 80 years of age with Parkinson's, I can do it. A 60-minute flight that for these trailblazing tourists will last a lifetime. It was so beautiful, just breathtaking, and I just felt this total connection. It's something so deep within yourself, like that feeling that you have in your heart when you just know that you love someone or something so truly. Much-needed perspective from a spaceship called Unity. Gotti Schwartz, NBC News, Upham, New Mexico. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.